with colored ink on paper. So I utilize a variety of brushes such as bamboo, pens, calligraphy brushes, or spray bottles, or essentially anything I can find that makes an interesting mark on paper. And I apply water and ink onto paper with these tools. Um, and sometimes um, pleasant surprises happen when water and in ink um, intermix on paper, and sometimes there are accidents. But I learn, I've learned to accept um, to like what happens on the paper with ink and water. And one, I guess, one fact that surprised people about me is that I actually have a science background. So I spent um, a few years conducting research on Alzheimer's disease. Um, and actually my art is greatly inspired by what I saw while I was conducting research. So um, I spent hundreds of hours um, looking at neurons and they're under the electron microscope. And they're so beautiful, these fluorescing structures and networks um, under, under the electron uh, microscope. So I, I was greatly mesmerized by uh, their complex structures and their beauty. So often you can find delicate lines in my artworks that kind of extend um, and protrude to form beautiful networks that both resemble neuronal networks and social networks. I think there are, there are two major things that really inspired me. Uh, the first thing is nature. So I used to live near Central Park and I find it great to have a walk um, in, in the forest and be transported um, back through time to kind of imagine what the trees were like when they were little, many, many years ago when Burning Free just started as a little city. <laughs> and the other thing is the amazing people that inhabit this area um, and the relationships, the social networks. Um, and the cultures that these people bring to the city. It has definitely changed a lot. Um, so with galleries closing or events being limited, um, artists really, they don't have a physical place to gather together, um, to either talk about art during openings, during events, to communicate. So um, I actually feel very isolated especially in the beginning of the, uh, the COVID-19 social distancing um, um, thing. So I, I feel I've started to explore what connection and relationship is about. I can do more um, of that in my artwork. Um, and I started seeing networks, social networks um, in, my, in my paintings.